squash and I have some broccoli with some seasoning. This is my meal prep for the week. I am. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. It is your girl Tamika. Hello gorgeous. If you are new, again, welcome. For all of my new subscribers or those who are just tuning in, just so happen to scroll through, here on my channel I do inspire women to put themselves first. I also encourage you on your fitness or weight loss journey. I am on a fitness journey so it is more entail about uh, lifting weights and gaining muscle. Please go ahead and consider subscribing here. I do uh, motivational chats, tips. And I also share my journey with you every Monday, which is now going to be called Fit Girl Mondays instead of a Weight Loss Monday. And I'm basically going to share my workouts and also what I eat in a day. So remember, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And thank you so much for all of my return subscribers. Hello, gorgeous. All right. So um, <laughs> it is Monday and today is... A federal holiday so your girl is off I'm so excited I'm so happy to be off um, this was a crazy crazy morning however your girl was still able to get her walk in and I'm going to show you a little clip of me in London taking a nice beautiful walk but for the start of the show it is basically I am going to be showing you uh, my grocery haul so this is a couple of things that I got from Walmart uh, and a couple of other little places. Just make sure that if you are on a calorie deficit that you at least invest in a food scale. You can get it from Amazon. They are pretty cheap. So let's go ahead and get right into this video, okay? All right, we got some goodies. All right, so first we're going to start with the Stokes coffee. Now I love Stokes coffee, but they can be a little bit expensive, you know? But Stokes coffee and this right here. See, and this Premier together is bomb. I love it. I tried using the Premier with regular coffee and it does not work. For me, the taste is not there, but this is given. So these two combinations are very, very good. You get 30 grams of protein. Here I am running low, but girl, something. This coffee, I mean this uh, silk protein, 20 grams of protein. This thing is thick. It is super thick. It's not like the silk one right here, where it's only how many? Would it say one gram of protein? This is watery. You can hear that. This. That's how thick it is. If you're gonna make a smoothie, if you like thick smoothies, then you might wanna try this right here. But if not, and if you are like a texture freak like me, uh, you will not want to do that. I tried halfing it up with water, but I love the idea that you get 20 grams of protein with one cup. So, mm, it's to each his own, but um, this was actually my first time trying this brand, and it is a little bit on the thick side. But when I use my um, my whey protein, which is 30 grams on top of the 20, girl, you get 50 grams, all right? All right, so next we're gonna move along. We have our Kosher's pickles. I love having pickles with my sandwiches. Um, here we have some spring mix to make some salads. And if I want to put some chicken on here, I can or I can make little wraps. I do have some carb control wraps where um, I can use this as well. So this will be part of my, my meal prep. Here we got some fresh strawberries. We got some apples. Um, here I have some squash. I have zucchini, which I am going to make a meal prep later on today. Um, so I'm gonna use this. Also, I got some red potatoes, which I'm going to mix that all together. So just stay tuned because I am going to do a meal prep for this a meal prep for this week. Ice 
I love this brand ice oh my gosh this is like so delicious this is more of a replacement of a soda so if you are a soda type person or you don't want to drink diet sodas which is not the healthiest version either but um ice is really really good oh I want to show you that I did get some kombucha uh who is it healthy G mom she had one but I think it was uh synergy or whatever girl I tried this I don't know about y'all but this right here I have to literally chug this down you know what this thing tastes and smell like apple cider vinegar with a with soda acid in it <laughs> oh my gosh that thing is like so 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 strong but anywho mm. I don't know. I'm not with the whole kabucha thing. Maybe I just got the wrong kind. All right. So moving right along. Here we have our ham and turkey. So these are going to make the sandwiches. Um, so this one says about four slices. I got me some skinny girl uh, salad dressing. This one is five calories. I'm used to the, uh, what did you call it? The um, Olive Garden. I love the Olive Garden, but that one is like 35 grams of calories. Um, yeah, it's 35 grams of calories for the light and about 80 for the regular. But I just decided to go ahead and just try this. Now here I have some oatmeal. Now with this oatmeal, this is not the best, but however, when it comes down to me meal prepping and when I go to work, these do come in handy. So that way I don't have to cook anything before I leave. Here goes the snacks. I love these uh, 70 calorie snacks. So like if I want something chocolate, I can have that. If I want like a birthday cake, which I'm not really a big fan of. And then here's another drink that I can mix with my water. I love the tang. I love these. And then here is my first time actually trying these. It's the Kind Breakfast Peanut Butter Bars. Um, you get two of them for 220 calories with five grams of protein. Not my best, but I'm a big Cliff Girl peanut butter type brand granola bar. I love those protein bars they are the best so if you haven't tried them go ahead and try it you can get them at your local um, Walmart they didn't have any so I just went ahead and tried the kind bars as far as like my pre-workout I don't do a pre-workout because that's just added calories so instead I just drink some black coffee and put a little bit of lemon in it and that's my pre-workout and that's what gives me my energy to work out okay and let's see what else as far as my bread I do the Sara Lee delight which is only 40 45 grams of calories I'm sorry 45 calories so I do that and sometimes I do the low carb solar bread so if I want to do more of a low carb breakfast or a low carb dinner I'll have that as well and I also have the low carb low carb wrap so these right here, I love these. These come in handy again when I want to do low carb for a meal. I don't do low carb on a regular basis, but when I want to incorporate it, especially on days that I do not lift, I do want to incorporate at least one to two meals out of the day with low carb. Um, Let's see here. Your girl got some broccoli. Um, Let's see. I got me some ground turkey. I got another ground turkey. Um, I do have some of these blueberries. I went to the Dollar Tree because I like their tropical mixed fruit, but they didn't have any, so it's all good. I'm gonna just use regular ice cream to mix with mine. So when I mix ice cream, just one tablespoon of strawberry ice cream. Half in the calories. You got to learn how to work it. Where is it? Where's my spinach? Hold on. And then when I mix it with spinach, with my vanilla whey protein powder, with some strawberry ice cream. Oh my gosh. 
Remember, just one tablespoon of strawberry ice cream. This tastes just like pistachio. It tastes so good, so good, so good, so good. Uh, let's see. And that's about it, <laughs> basically. And I also did get me some more containers. Got these from Dollar General. So I got these containers, they were only for a dollar. So instead of going to Dollar Tree, which is like a dollar 25 now, I just went ahead and grabbed me some that were actually a dollar out the dollar section of Dollar General. All right, so that is basically all I have far as, oh, I forgot to show you my bacon. So now when I want some breakfast on the go, just whip this up, put it in the microwave, put it in one of those containers, and I'm good to go. Also, I want to show you, um, I do love to eat pancakes. So these Kodak protein uh, powder pancakes, these are so good. If you mix it with milk, it tastes even better, which will be 17 grams of car. I'm sorry, 17 grams of protein. Or if you do milk and egg, it is 20 grams of protein. Now, because this silk here is very very thick this here will be in a good combination these two will be a good combination because it'll thicken up the batter and make it taste really really good also if i wanted to make ice cream so instead of just using the strawberry uh great value brand ice cream i can make my own ice cream by using protein powder bananas and if you wanted to add this little thick thickness right here that you can barely hear <laughs> if you want to add some silk in it to thicken it up for the consistency of an ice cream you can also do that as well but no this is not old this is really 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 thick all right so that is all I have to show you guys when it comes down to my grocery haul oh I got one more thing let me show you which is the fruit and yogurt. I love to have this on the go again, or a great snack. So that is all I have to show you. Um, thank you so much for tuning in and make sure that you are subscribed to the channel. Make sure you turn on that bell notification so you do not miss any uploads that I do every Monday regarding the Fit Girl Mondays. And also I do vlogs and I do what I eat in the day, all of that. So make sure you have your bell notification turned on. All right, so thank you so much for tuning in. I will check you girls out later. Goodbye, gorgeous, and make sure you stick to your weight loss or fitness journey. You only have one life, so make sure you do it. Stick to it, stay consistent, and just keep pushing. Again, thank you so much. Give this video a thumbs up. Peace.